Thanks for coming back to the shop. Today something a little different. Uh, I've got this belt sander that I recently put the made the tool rest for. Um, but I made a mistake. I went ahead and ordered belts for this and I, I just incorrectly assumed that I knew the size without measuring anything. So I ordered 1 inch by 30 belts which are far too short. So what I need to do now is calculate out how long this needs to be. And just so you just have some idea that there's there's more than one way to do this. Uh, typically, with lawnmower belts and things like that, it's slightly more complicated because of the depth of the V belts. But in this case, it's really simple because you just take a piece of string, run it around, and mark it. In this case, I've already marked it, measured it, and I know that this belt is 42 inches long. But let's say you had a big bandsaw or something that wasn't quite as easy to to access with a piece of rope or you're by yourself and it's really big. Uh, anyway, whatever the scenario is, if you wanted to go about measuring or getting at least a, a pretty good idea of what length belt you have, if you have a, a calculator or a pen and pencil or whatever, uh, it'd be pretty easy to calculate by just figuring out the diameter. And in this case, I've I've gone ahead and take a magic marker and marked this this wheel here and, and I measured the wheel. So measure the wheel, determine that it's three and a half inches long. So I need to do two pi uh, times a radius. So so do two times pi times the radius, which is 1.75. I get right at 11 inches. So I've got each revolution of this is going to be 11 inches. So we go ahead and mark off counter marks. I got one, 11 inches, two, 22 inches, 33, oh, and we gone past it a little bit, but you know what? I'm going to take a mark here. I know I'm at 44 inches there, and I back it off just a little bit, and I see that I've got about an inch and a half or so of, uh, of room between that mark and that mark. Is that that's showing up in the picture? Anyway, but I, I can go ahead and ballpark it. Now I know that this belt is about 43 inches long. So anyway, I hope that's helpful to somebody. Uh, again, not, not, not earth shatteringly math or anything like that, but you know, uh, another practical way to just come about at least ballparking the, uh, the, the size that you need and not making dumb decisions and, and guessing the things and, and wasting good money on parts that don't fit. So anyway, thanks for watching.